This video will cover 100 civics questions and answers with one answer each. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Obey the laws of the United States. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? American Indians. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Vote in a federal election. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for civil rights. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Provide schooling and education. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do?
fought for civil rights. What major event happened on September 11, 2001 in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. What did the Declaration of Independence do? said that the United States is free. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? the Speaker of the House. Who makes federal laws? Congress. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? Louisiana. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. slavery. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. In what month do we vote for president? November. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech. 
freedom of religion. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote, join a political party. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life, liberty. Who is the commander in chief of the military? The president. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Pelosi. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Missouri. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? the vice president. Why do the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? civil rights. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty-five. How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty seven. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? the Senate, and House. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. J. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Jefferson. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s.
World War II. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. What is one reason colonists came to America? Freedom. Who was the first president? Washington. What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Roosevelt. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Crow. Name two national U.S. holidays.
New Year's Day, President's Day. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. What is an amendment? A change. When was the Constitution written? 1787. Who was president during World War I? Wilson. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific. Who is the father of our country? Washington. How many U.S. Senators are there? 100. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? U.S. diplomat. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 1776. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? 18 and older. Where is the Statue of Liberty?
New York. When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. We elect a president for how many years? Four. Who vetoes bills? The president. Who signs bills to become laws? The president. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Harris. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Biden. Name your U.S. representative. Answers here will vary as well. You can go to house.gov and type in your zip code on the top of the page. Then you will need to type in your address to find your specific representative. Who is the governor of your state? Answers here will vary as well. Go to usa.gov slash state dash governor to choose your state to find the name of your governor. What is the capital of your state? Okay, answers will vary here, of course. Please find the capital of your state. And if you live in Washington, D.C., you can say that D.C. is not a state and does not have a capital. Who is one of your state's U.S. senators now? Answers will vary here depending where you live. To find your senators, go to senate.gov and choose your state to show your senators.